apart with all of our routines disrupted in one way or another. Some people are definitely having a hard time finding a way to exercise. Yeah, and it's really important too. Mike Shu met a woman who is fighting her own battle to keep others healthy. Strolling with the baby, getting out with the dog, or reading a book, it is good to get moving outside. Perhaps no one knows this better than Krista Michael and Donnie Singer. Besides being a couple, they run fit to go personal training. We do have the bands on our shoulders. While Krista has gotten to be a whiz at instructing over the internet, on this day, she's happy to be setting up outside <laughs> with her client, Carrie Phillips. Okay, squeezing your shoulder blades behind you. Carrie's job spans multiple time zones, so she's on calls before dawn until after sunset. She admits she needs someone to motivate her. I'll get sucked into work and I'll do other things and not prioritize this. So I need the schedule like to be accountable to a time and a class. Krista agrees. So I feel like it makes the workouts more productive. People look forward to them more. Did you hear that? People looking forward to something. With lives turned upside down, looking forward to something, anything, is important for the mind and soul. If I can do it, anybody can do it. <laughs> she says that because she has a form of leukemia that makes her immunocompromised, and her life story motivates her and her clients. It definitely helps too because I am, um, you know, the rewarding experience that I get from training clients and helping people, I still get that because I'm still able to see my clients, I'm still able to talk to them, I'm still able to coach them every day and see the progress they make. Progress, the client reminds us, is more than just physical. Working out is like my, your way, I guess my way of clarity instead of from the work stress. Bring the bands up on your shoulders. Guided by a teacher who's doing her best to stay healthy in a world suddenly much more dangerous to her. In Canton, I'm Mike Shue for WJZ.